I have used in the past different desoldering methods but when it comes to ICs of 20 or more pins you need something reliable. This might be a little expensive but useful if you plan to do multiple projects. Just be aware of keep cleaning consistently after at least 10-15 times of continuous usage. By cleaning I mean the nozzle and also chamber. However I would not recommend to solder due to its tip. Also after finish with all work tin the tip with solder to avoid some saturation and moisture into the gun. Works great and wish I bought it sooner. I was using a pencil type suction desoldering iron before. And just couldn't get enough heat and suction to remove simple through hole caps. The older the solder, the harder it was. This machine is god sent. Let it warm up. Tin the tip and go. Keep you too well tin so it doesn't oxidize. I was on the fence for a long time. But so happy I bought it. I have never had a quality desoldering tool before. I've depended on squeeze bulb tools and desoldering braid for 50 years. But I had a need to take apart a sealed device and thought I'd give this a try. Like the old saying goes this changes everything it works. And it works well. If you don't have a desoldering station, you need this. I do a fair bit of repair work on vintage electronics and I wanted to have something better than the solder pulse or solder wick braid for removing bad components. Worked very well. Key is adding some fresh solder and flux. After that it left very clean holes. Much quicker and cleaner than braid.